just for fun, but it is. It's fun. It is. Be back. Time to uh, continue on to take out. Going down, huh? Sorry, I, I almost made a crest joke, but I'm, I'm going to save it. I'm going to save it. We're better than that. No crest jokes from me. That's a promise. Not from me, anyways. You might warp in some bases and... Lord only knows, but you know, for me over here as a gun character sidekick, no crass jokes. 100% on the level with you and no bad stuff. Fuck, it stopped? Oh, what year is it? I'm just fucking with ya. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, no, no, no.
securing post. Give my freedom, you know. I would just say, No, I, just, I want to sell. I hope you enjoy your purchase. The G3 will certainly enjoy the extra fun. Attention, Iron Operation 12. See, it's me, Krubus. Speed things up. I'm fucking underwater here trying to keep things on schedule. And I figured maybe you forgot that if you piss me off, I will kill you. It's really easy to find more slaves. Look, just do your job and mine more Fergos. Krubus out. Holy shit. Hey, he's got a Gatlion. We, we gotta rescue it. keep asking them to get a canary in case we hit a vein of carbon monoxide. You know, us moplets can breathe carbon monoxide, so we'd be fine. We just think it would be fun to rescue a dying bird. You know, anything to feel emotions again. Mining Operation 12C. Because they're fucking dead! Looks like most of them got crushed in a- We're here to work. <laughs> Fantastic. You look sharp. <laughs> I think the team's really going to like you, hon. Let's get you all set up. Head on into the next room and find a place to work. Go on without me. I haven't left this chair in years, and I don't plan to start now. <laughs> uh, thank God they're here. Hey, you must be the new office clerk, right? Just sort through that paperwork for us. We're so small. Uh, shh. Sure. Uh, yes. I will see what I can do. Oh, jeez. Okay, this is more paperwork than I anticipated. All right, better get to work. So, you still good for Hyper Feast later? What time did you say again? Uh, Zorg. Oh, yeah. Zorg totally works. Hey, newbie. You know Hyper Feast? They create new life in front of you, and you get to eat it alive? Shit's wild, man. Hyper feast. <laughs> See you there, girlfriend. You're my girlfriend. We're dating. Oh, my God. I'm going insane. I'm going fucking nuts. What? Yeah, uh, 
God, I think my brain's breaking. I, I think doing this job is making my brain break completely. Oh, yeah, me too, me too. It's fun. You don't mind your brain breaking? But you don't mind the, this fucking monotonous... And done! Finally! But you don't mind the, this fucking monotonous nightmare work? No, no, it's nice. It's cool to just give into a broken brain. I can't do math anymore. And if I stay here another year, I think I'll forget how to say three-syllable words. Okay, that honestly doesn't sound so bad. It's not bad. It's terrific. Fantastic. Amazing. Three words I won't be able to say next year, so stay with them now. Oh, buddy, I will. You know, I, I kind of don't mind this at all. Ow, paper cut! Uh, just kidding. Huh. It would have been you. You would have been the one to get the paper cut. Paper, hyper beast again. <sighs> Don't you listen to anything? We said Zorg. Zorg. Ah, right, right. All in a day's work. Glad we got that all done. There, are, there definitely is not going to be a third stack. Ah, uh, the cold sting of irony. Is, is that ironic? I, I never really know. Ah, right, right. Damn. I just remembered I had something going on at Zorg. Holy shit, I, I am, I'm gonna blow my fucking brains out. What? Oh, I didn't see you there. Do you, do you still sit here? That's so funny. Yeah, this is so my spot. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. It does, it does, yeah. I, I think if I if I sit back down at my desk, my soul is just gonna leave my body. Okay, well, I've got work to do. Yeah, I know, me too. I, I, I have to do all this fucking work. This is the whole fucking problem, man. Look, just because we used to be married doesn't mean you can keep leaning on me to work through your issues. That was one night. We got married for one dumb night. Oh, okay, we're done. No more paperwork. Did you hear me? I said no more paperwork. Not even a fourth stack. Okay, good. God damn, you filled out those papers. Fuck you, you're, you're promoted. You're free to go into Krubus's office. Why? Because fuck you. That's why I don't need a fucking reason. I'm boss McBossington. And I'll be in here jerking off or whatever. Fucking other stuff too. I don't, I don't give a shit. Huh? So this must be Krubus's office. There's gotta be something here we can use. Where are you? This is Garmantuous. I just checked the log and you're three days behind schedule with the latest shipment. But you know what? It's not that big of a fucking deal. These Fergals aren't gonna be worth shit now that we discovered humans. Might even have to shut this whole operation down just to get all hands on deck over on Earth. I can give your territory to the Screndel brothers and have them expand their facilities to find out more about these humans. Oh, have you tried one of these fuckers yet? Oh, God, the high? It's otherworldly. Can't believe a species like this really exists. Humans! <laughs> Who'd have even thought? Anyway, don't fuck up again, even if it doesn't matter, or I'll smoke you myself. Oh, would you look at that? He, he marked his coordinates on the calendar. Shit! All right, now we just need a blank warp disk to encode this on. The mob is responsible, but it looks like they died in the cave in. That's right, Good old Kenny. Hello, hello, anyone? Help! We we really captured one of our captors, but uh, 
Um, we do not know what to do next. Don't mind. Ah, don't, don't, don't give me in trouble. Calm down. We're on your side. <clears throat> Fuck the G3. Oh, wonderful. Thank God. <sighs> Just tell us the plan. We have started our resistance. Not only do the G3 enslave us, but they have desecrated our holiest of sites and absconded with our sweet prince. Prince Chosen One, that's, that's him. Prince Chosen One. Nice, I already see where this is going and I love it. You're gonna torture this sad sack merc for intel. Oh, hmm. yeah, that's smart. No, we, we didn't think of that at all. But it's fine, we know where the prince is. They swapped him out with the rest of our sacred grounds when they warped in a new base. Well, that's easy. We can just clear out their base and warp back the throne room. Oh, heaven! Uh, Would you really do all that for us? The base is just past this tunnel. Thank you, uh, thank you, thank you. Your prince is really named Prince Chosen One? Yes! Yeah. He was named as such according to the prophecy. And then after that, he was made into a prince. Wait, you choose your princes based on prophecies? No wonder he couldn't stop his people from being enslaved. Uh, well, the prophecy doesn't guarantee he's going to be good at his job. It just tells us who to pick. Look, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. Look, now is not the time to criticize us. We're, I'm just, you know, we're distressed as it is. I'm just doing my job. We need a blank warp disk. Got one? Ah, uh, yes. Our prince has a stash of them. Whoa, for real? All you need to do is clear out the warp base the G3 plopped on in our holy land. Then you'll reclaim the sacred grounds and rescue Prince <gasps> Chosen One. And then we grab a blank disc from the prince. Perfect. Yes, oh, yes, we can, we can help each other. Oh, what a fortuitous <sighs> happenstance. Oh, we're done here. <laughs> You know, this prince dude better be worth saving. He better be really handsome and charming, or I'm gonna feel bamboozled. Don't let it happen again! That's the base we're looking for! Come on, time to get violent. find a warp disk in here. Cool. Go outside and swap this place out with the Moplet special little church. Lorb is the chosen one? He's as lazy as the name they gave him. And what the hell do you want? Hey, dipshit, you know we just saved you, right? Saved me from what? 
I'm fine. Oh, fuck. Whatever. Can we bum a blink warp disc? Huh? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, sure. I've got a bunch. All right, we got everything. Take us back to Ranchy's shithole mansion and we'll hijack his encoding machine. Prince Chosen One has returned. Oh, Glad we found this shortcut. I know you're doing all the walking, but I'm exhausted. Flagorb? I don't want Flagorb. I want Flagorb. You're all dick dang blue. Just try and find a chosen one better than me. I dare you. Oh, no, 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 no. Please, please. It, it is already written in the prophecy. Set in stone for eons to come. You are the chosen one. There is no one. Do not give. We're back. Let's let's head inside. Hey, uh, you're back. Ah, thank God. Thank fucking God. Uh, did you bring my Fergal? Uh, I need it bad. Uh, I need my fix, kid. Oh, I need it bad. I need it real bad. Oh Jesus Christ, man. Hey, are you all right? Uh, are you are you having a heart attack or? or is it, is it Fergal withdrawals? Does that make you happy? Oh, you love that, don't you? You love to see a uh, master of industry all flummoxed like this, all low and, uh, yeah, maybe, maybe. Uh, uh maybe this is a bad time, but could we use your disc encoder real quick? What? No, the encoder is off limits until I get my goddamn Fergal fix. Fergals, get him. Hurry, hurry. Uh, hey, tell you what, we're gonna go ahead and use the disc encoder while you're sort of, uh, stuck on the ground like that, doing whatever it is you're doing. So, don't be mad at us. Fuck. Fuck. All right, looks like it's working. I'm in a bad spot, man. I don't feel so good. I don't, I don't, I don't feel so good at all. Oh, I'm so cold. Oh, I'm so hot. Oh, I'm fucking boiling. Did someone turn on the AC? Oh, oh no. Oh, no. I, I shit. Huh. I shit myself. Oh, oh no. I pissed myself. And the piss was mixing with the shit into a shit piss. 
and it's all under me, and I'm, I'm just lying in my own shit fist. Don't look, don't look, don't look, don't look, come near me. I just, what the fuck you want to see that for? What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? you get a kick out of that? I don't want to see a man lying and sweating in his own shit fist. You're a pervert. I fucking hate you. you All right, there we go. Like Time to warp in Krubus and then, you know, kill him if, if, if we're able you to. to y me. You ready? You don't even work for Krubus, do you? You are never even gonna ever get my Fergals. Uh, please, get me Fergals. idea. What if we just swap out this mansion for Krubus's base? Kill me. Ah, that's it. I'm smoking a burgle. Krubis, I want you to know this is personal. I'm killing you because I specifically want to watch you die. Not out of revenge or justice or anything. I'm just Ha <laughs> ha! 
Up there, wasn't I? Sorry about that. Ooh. Hey, bud, the name's Gus. Feel good to meet you. Look at you, man. Pretty slick taking out Krubis like that, rescuing me from indentured servitude, etc. etc. I love that kind of stuff. You no, know I love that. That's the kind of stuff I love, man. Do you mind if I tag along with you for a bit? I, of course. I, I, that's what I was hoping you'd say. We can use your help. But I should be clear that we are trying to take down the whole G3 cartel, and we might die. Music to my ears. You think I don't want to take down the cartel? Buddy, that's all I want to do. That's all I dream about. Amazing. God, I'm so glad to find another Gatlian alive and well. I love your tiny little hands, by the way. I, I, I had a cousin who had those tiny hands. He died in the zombie apocalypse on Gatlas, but, you know, look, I'm sure you don't want to hear about that. We had to live through it. I mean, you know, who wants to talk about that? Oh, shit. Time to fight. far away. I'm not sure you can jump to that one. Oh, hey! It's me, Quentin the Grinch again. Your best friend. I actually decided to pack things up and rejoin the team 3 Do you mind if I kill you real quick? <laughs> Let's see how much you talk when you're dead. Finally! Enough of that guy. They kicked him out of the G3 because he was so damn annoying. He's lonely, he's bitter, and Get a life. Some people need a life, and he needed a life, man. Freedom, baby. I already felt free when you saved me from Krubus. But now that we're out of the pit, I really feel free.
kid? Another one down, huh? Great work. <laughs> but, uh, hey, there's something you should see. Take a look after you turn in your bounty. So I wouldn't have to watch the rest of this freak show flick. Do humans really like this stuff? Don't touch that dial. We'll be right back after this short break. <laughs> All right, good. Get over here. Check this out. Hello, Blim City citizens. That's Clug Nugman, Blim City magistrate. As you all know, I'm working hard to flush out all the crime and drugs from our streets. I'll be the first to admit, we haven't made much headway in the fight against the G3 cartel. All right, all right. Now catch this next bit. All about to change. We've learned of a bold bounty hunter who's been bravely taking this G3 matter into their own hands. You hear that? He's talking about you! They've already dealt with two of the cartel's most powerful officers. Yeah, you got lucky. I am not too proud to ask for help in our war on drugs. Bounty Hunter, if you're listening, please consider joining forces with the good people of Blim City. I hope you'll choose to come forward and meet with me personally at my office in City Hall. I mean, we might as well hear them out, right? I already told him you go. Without even asking us first? No, don't start. Trust me, he's legit. This guy's been anti-G3 since before any of you were even in diapers. Honestly, I don't know if Gatlin's even wear diapers. Head through there. Clug's expecting you. Come on. You know how hard it is to get a meeting with the magistrate? Hey, where the hell are you going? Go talk to Clug. Jesus! Thank you so much for coming, Bounty Hunter. Our pleasure. Nice view you've got up here. Look, I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. You're a human, correct? My men looked into it. Sorry. You survived the G3's attack on your home planet Earth, right? Yeah, they're a human. We're Gatlians. Of course. Sorry. I'm familiar with your plight as well. It's such a tragedy what happened on Gatlas. It makes much sense that you and the humans would join forces, but perhaps you have room for one more ally as well? A lawless bounty hunter teaming up with a squeaky clean politician. <laughs> really? That's precisely why I need your help. I'm having the darndest time curbing the species drug trade. I can only do so much, and only within the confines of the law. I mean, I've got my hands full with Gary the Poisoner. He's not just poisoning the water supply, he's moved on to poisoning weirder stuff now, like street lamps. We don't even know how that works, or if it's actually a problem. Maybe it's fine to poison street lamps. I'm a bit overwhelmed, and I wish I could focus more time on the G3. But you, you've taken out two top G3 officers in less time than it takes us to file a single report. So you see how you can help me, but there's also one way I can help you. Go on, let me take it all in. This tool on my desk here will help you rescue your fellow humans. You can use it to teleport them to a safe haven my team has arranged for them to stay at until the G3 are dealt with. Please take a look at this tool. Let me get this straight. You're giving this to us for free. Well, the human species is technically a drug. I can't have dangerous sentient drugs in the hands of my citizens, and you can't have your people getting captured and consumed. This solves both of our problems, assuming you plan to continue taking out the G3. That's right. Then, thank you. Sincerely, you humans and Gatlians, you're both very noble species. This means a lot to me. I've made it my life's work to use my power to help people in need, but even I have my limits. I'm just glad I have someone like you to turn to. As a token of thanks, my team will be feeding any intel we find on the G3 directly to your handler, Mr. Zaruthian. We've already sent him everything we had. The rest is in your hands. We appreciate that, pal. If it's okay if I call you pal. That's all I have for you. Feel free to stay as long as you like. The view is breathtaking. Oh, uh, feel free to stay as long as you'd like. Hey, look at us, and we're back. Oh. So, 
<laughs> it went well, huh? I got a message saying they'll hook us up with any G3 intel they find. Yeah, and they hooked us up with a way to save humans. God damn. You got it easy. Nothing as convenient as this ever happened when I was bounty hunting. Hey, uh, speaking of, we should get you a jetpack before you head back out into the field. You're really gonna need it. Head on down to the pawn shop and see if they got one in stock. Oh, and yeah, you might want to hit up Bordo's chef stand, too. It's a little shady, but uh, those warp discs he's selling can be pretty helpful. Hello, and welcome to Human TV, your number one choice for the scariest human movies fresh off the newly discovered planet Earth. I'm your horrific homo sapien host, Humandor, the human. That's right, I'm a real human. We're looking for a jetpack. A jetpack? Oh, certainly. I can help. Uh, I can help. Ah, jetpack, huh? Great choice. Really phenomenal choice. Let's lock that purchase in. Cool, so where's the jetpack? Not so fast. I gotta back order that bad boy. I'll have it ready for you in a couple of days, I promise. No refunds, by the way. This purchase is final. Well, I was really kinda hoping we would get it right away. Deal's a deal, no take backs. So, uh, how's that mother of yours, George? She sucks. Come on now, that's no way to talk about the Schweeb who birthed you. Yeah, right, and it's fun for me to say mean things. It gives me a little thrill every time I even think that I'd hit my mom. I get this insane burst of adrenaline. I don't know what it is. Maybe this is just what being a teenager is like. This is some rebellious puberty shit, I bet. Check this out. My mom smells like shit. Okay, you can't tell, but I just got an insane dopamine rush right now. Is it sexual thrill? God, I hope not. But it might be. It really genuinely might be, and I'm gonna choose not to self-reflect on that any further. My mom stinks like shit. Fuck! I could do this all day of practically vibrating. I guess I just don't understand kids these days. Just what a fucking cookie. concessions guy I'd like to sell you illegal stuff over here I think that guy's trying to get our attention
talking gun. I'm the little concession man. I got illegal things for you. Come over here. You can buy illegal things for me. You really want to kill them? Here, Sorry, what's no up? Dice. My name's Stan, and I sell vials of alien cum. I know that's probably not what you wanted to hear when you walked over here. You want it cum or what? Promise me we'll take a break soon and just go for a nice walk or something. I love killing aliens, don't get me wrong, but we gotta remember to take care of ourselves from time to time, you know? All right, I get it. You know, you don't you don't want my alien come. I told you. Okay, you saunter away. I wasn't saying that. Oh, okay, yeah, just walk away. Careful, I'm contagious.
how to go. Did you get a jetpack? Yeah, but Mr. Keith's got it on back order, so we gotta wait. Great. Perfect excuse for a rest. We're still waiting on Clug's intel anyway. Why don't you go to bed and sleep off some of that excitement? I'm a little drowsy. I can use a little sleep myself. Hmm. So this is where the magic happens, huh? Hey, good night, partner. I'm just gonna sit right here and watch you fall asleep. I'm really glad we met. You know, I, I think I think we're doing something amazing here. How cool would it be if we actually stopped the G3? Sorry, sorry, I'm, I, I, I'm just, I'm excited. I'll shut up. L let's get some sleep. Pretty soon, you know, we'll be jetpacking across all of space. Sorry, I'm, I'm being too loud. You're probably trying to, let's get you to sleep. Let's take this jetpack for a spin. Can you make it over that gap? Stop. Holy shit, this rules! I'll buy it right now. I'll buy Damn, you're just like a TonyHawk.com jetpack pro. The actor, you know, he's good, but he, he, he didn't know that we, that we actually had to buy this website. I own it. Well, it's just too cheap, I own it. Okay, now that we... Check out that landing, tell you gene was right that is gonna come in handy it's also fun you can fly while doing combat it's a very cool uh feature that we have here we put a lot of time and effort into it let's head back and talk to gene and see if there's any new bounties all right i'm uh, stopping right here ah it's getting heavy so save all that good Flippity flip.